Hey guys, so a pre-Hungarian video blog here for you. Um, it's currently Thursday evening, just got back from the track. Uh, it was a standard preparation day uh, with the track walk, going over data, so it's fresh in my mind, and also discussing the run plan for free practice and a bit the strategy for the weekend. Um, this is actually the first track this year that I've driven uh, last year with a GP2 car, so I'm hoping I'm going to be able to use that uh, experience to my advantage, because what I found with all the races I've done so far is that uh, having done at least one race, the experience you get is really invaluable, and seeing how managing the tires is obviously the main difficulty of the championship, having experienced that uh, on each specific track is really an advantage. Um, it's also going to be quite hot uh, this weekend, it's probably going to be high 20s to low 30s uh, throughout the whole weekend. Um, you know, the track itself is not so many high speed corners, but uh, it's very technical uh, and there's a lot of back to back corners with not a lot of rest. So that's going to make it quite challenging with the heat, uh, you know, to make it quite a physical challenge this weekend. Um, it's like quite a lot of softer compared to, you know, the Monaco, but for, for normal tracks, just because of uh, the short straight and the, the amount of focus you have to, to keep to, to be able to stay in a good rhythm and, and get good lap times. Uh, honestly, it's not uh, it's not my favorite track on the calendar, but uh, you know I'm hoping it's not going to uh, affect the results too much, and uh, and I'm really looking forward to see what the weekend brings. So hopefully, I'll have some good news to report back to you guys.